Do you have your drinks with tonic as the mixer? Well, today I'm having a vodka tonic made with 60ml vodka and 120ml tonic. And the main thing I want to see is how the spike and the crash compares to when I had coke and diet coke as the mixer. This drink should be about 175 calories. Let's see what happens. Tastes good, but to be honest, it does taste a little kadwa, but I guess it's an acquired taste. Okay, let's see what my glucose monitor says. 23 mg initial increase and then an eventually 15 mg fall below baseline. You know what this means? This means that tonic actually gave a better result compared to using coke as the mixer. Because vodka coke had given me an initial 32 mg spike, which is a lot higher than 23 mg. And here my blood sugar levels fell by 21 mg below baseline, which is also more than what happened with vodka tonic. So basically the initial spike and the crash were both lesser, which is a good thing. This could have happened because tonic has 8.8 .8 grams of sugar per 100 grams, which is slightly lesser compared to Coke's 10.6 grams of sugar per 100 grams. Another reason could be that tonic is bitter. So maybe I had the drink a lot slower compared to vodka Coke which I just guzzled down. And as a consequence, everything reached my system a little slower. And maybe that's why the spike and the crash were lower. Now I'm thinking, should I make a video on having a drink, say vodka with coke, but slower, just to see if the spike and the crash can be lowered? Let me know in the comments.